Let's check out Reddit. Ooh, Reddit. What do they have to say about Countersign Global Hollow Myth collab? I think Reddit is going to be so hype. What do you guys think? Let's check out Reddit reaction. Wow. Reddit reaction. C is dead. Long live C. Wow. First sentence. Drama. Damn. Damn. First sentence Reddit. 94 upvotes. Hype. Hype, man. Wow. C hater. Long live the sea, man. Long live the sea. Any sea haters, guys? Guys, I already told you guys yesterday. I already told you guys. I mean, two days ago. Is it yesterday or two days ago? I told you guys Zalong is working on a new hype anime. Zalong Dong is busy. Give them a chance. Give them a chance. They are busy for now. Maybe once they are done with the new anime, the new game, they come back to sea server. You get what I'm saying? Don't expect too much from Zalong Dong, small company, all right? Why would I hate on a... <laughs> Counter-Sight player trying to get Hollow Life. I'm new in Counter-Sight. What's the drama in C server? There's no drama in C server. C server is managed by a different uh, publisher, Zalong Dong. Right, Zalong Dong Games. Seriously speaking, C did receive the collab skins. Wait, 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 what, what? Seriously speaking, C did receive the collab skins as long as it's skins. If they are units, God only know when it ar arrive on C. So there's a chance that we can get this. What do you mean C did receive? And then there's a chance that we can get this. What do you mean? Huh? The problem is if we can only be bought by enemy coins and not quartz. So what is he saying? C did receive? Is he saying like if C did receive? <coughs> copium? The guy takes more copium. So no, he's saying that C did receive, and then here he said there's a chance. So what is he trying to say? I don't get it. What collab is that? Wait, there's a collab? Not sure if there's a collab or not. But the artist of Circle made skins of Nayubin's female. Oh! Oh, he's talking about the C. Okay, okay, I, I know what he's talking about. So in C server, so there's this thing. There's this artist thing. Uh, if you guys are not aware, right? In C server, there's the collab with this artist that drew... I don't know what's the name of the artist, but apparently it's a very famous hentai artist, literally. Like, this is his drawing style. His drawing style is like that. So this is for Awaken Amy skin. It's a collab with this artist. I don't know the artist's name. I think I think the Manhua or something, right? That's for Amy. Lee Jisoo has one as well. So this is Lee Jisoo's one. Wow, huge! No, no, not this one, this one. Wow. Amy is here. Lee Jisoo is here. What is this? What the, what is that is that? But yeah, this is Lee Jisoo's one. And the one that I have is uh Asterosa. And a lot of people were asking me how did I get that? Yeah, Asterosa is the uh also this one. Right? This is the one. So I only bought the Asterosa. I should have bought all three actually. It was limited. This skin is limited. Yeah, for, for, for those of you who don't know, this skin is limited in the Counterside C, and you can't get it anymore. So if I go to the shop, I don't think you can buy it anymore. So yeah, there's a chance that the... You cannot get it anymore, sadly. Right, you can get all of this, but none of the... None of the... Uh, the one. But you get the lollies, though. You can always get the lollies. Right? You get what I'm saying? Like, it's okay if you miss some skins. The lollies will always be there. Okay, let's have a look at what he's saying. So he's he's talking about this, which makes sense. And C did get it last time. Lolly is children day. Circles porn hua. My Google Play Store only allows me to download C. Dang, this guy is trying to play C server. 80% of the players are disappointed. Lol. Wow. My excitement plummeted. As soon as I saw, they were all skins. Not to say CS skins are bad or anything, they are great, but compared to a new unit, they are likely cost actual money and not quartz too. So if they are all obtainable through an event or something, then that's something at least I guess. Just sucks that Korea can get actual units, but global can. RIP C? Damn! Everyone is sitting 
on C! Stop, stop. Alright, guys, stop with the hit on C. Give Zelong Dong a chance. Zelong Dong is gonna come back. Trust me. <laughs> Global dead. Okay, what? Why skin over new characters? Come on. Like, I, I just talked about it in my latest video. I think skins is much easier to balance the game. You, I think they, they learn from that mistake, maybe? From the Guilty Gear collab. And it's hard for them to also work on the new characters just for global specifically. I don't think they will ever. Like, I, I not trying to talk trash about or not trying to talk low at Studio B-Side. I don't think they will ever do a dedicated unit collab for global because there's a lot of work and you can't apply it to KR. So KR will always be their favorite child. Uh, whatever that applies to KR, it's going to apply there first. I want the code gas units too. I want it too. I want the Code Gas units too. But the truth, the matter of the fact is, Code Gas, the collab is not with Studio B side. You get what I'm saying? The collab is with Nexon. If you know Nexon, Nexon is awesome. Big Nexon fan. Big Zelong fan and Nexon fan. The truth is, Nexon is not a sharing kind of person. Nexon, they only share with themselves. So therefore, Nexon uh, is managing KR. Only KR and JP gets it. Yeah, Zelong Dong is making Genshin, and it's not next Nexon. It's Nexon KR uh, side of things, so I don't know if Nexon NA and KR is like, can they like? I don't know. I think it's separate, separate entity. Code Gas is sick. If KR gets Hollow Life, they might do an actual unit collab next time. I don't know if KR is getting it. Does anyone know if KR is getting? Do anyone know? I think it's global exclusive. It's literally global exclusive. Maybe C. I think for now it's global exclusive. Okay. Uh, it is a wise skin. I wish we can make a poll to vote who is okay with just skins and who is not to get developer attention. Honestly, surprised the amount of people backing the collab event on Discord. Saying stuff like, people like me are delusional for expecting a new unit. I love Hololife, but this event is such a huge letdown. Wow. Wow. Global people will really defend anything. Or maybe they just got used to global always getting shafted. So they weren't surprised anymore. It was totally reasonable to expect collab units considering Guilty Gear and Code Gas collabs had them. And CG even had, Code Gas even had Awakened Unique Unit. I hope this is just them testing it out or still trying to find suitable IPs in the future. Yes, I hope, I hope this is the case. Uh, it, it will be depressing to think that we can't even get anything remotely close to those two collapse. I don't know, it's hard to compare a game and a ho hololife thing, right? Global player is such a defeatist. Players complaining about a let down collab while Taiwan has seen no collab. People are always going to complain about stuff on the inter internet, it's just what the internet is for, you know? You can't expect people to be, you know, to not be self-entitled. Okay, I think they just don't want to aggro KR community by releasing new unit, new exclusive employees. I personally expected them to just be operators. Do you guys think the Korean players will be upset if Global gets an exclusive collab? I think that could be also a thing, right? So think about it, right? Counter-side counter -side is big. Massive. So we have Counter-side Korea. First one, Counter-Side Korea. And then, second one that ever released was Counter-Side Taiwan. Taiwan, wow. Which is not to be confused with Counter-Side China. Different, different. Taiwan, China, different. All right, so you guys know. And then Counter-Side C came along. Counter-Side C came along. Wow, this was huge. Just so you guys know, Counter-Side C and Counter-Side Taiwan, both is the long dong. It's the long dong. Alright. And then we have Counterside JP. Nexon. Nexon, right? Counterside JP is Nexon. So Nexon, KR, Nexon. So whatever the KR gets, JP so far is getting. So both of them get caught gas. Alright, so just so you guys know. And then here comes Counterside Glow Bug Global. Alright, Counterside Global came the last. So here's the thing, if Counterside Global gets collab, and these other Counterside do not get the collab, 
Wow! Huge drama in Counterside community. Huge drama. You get what I'm saying? But when this happens in KR and JP, no huge drama. No huge drama. But if Global gets it, I think it will be huge drama. Because Global is the latest server, right? The other server don't get it? I think, it, I think there's some sort of truth. There is some sort of truth to this, right? You get what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure like, it will stir, at least it will stir this side. This one, maybe they don't care as much. C server is going to bitch about it on Facebook. I, 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 I noticed C server like to use Facebook. JP is going to be quite loud. I think JP and KR is going to be quite loud if Global get something that, you know, the other counter side don't get. So I, I can see some sort of truth. And I guess they just want peace. They want nothing but peace. Unless they just merge. C on Zook Book Lamao. I don't really mind the idea of skins if they are free, which is unlikely. But considering there is totally new currency in pre-register event, maybe it can be used on skins, unless it's only for stickers and stuff. Yeah, that's also one thing that... If you guys are not aware, right? Last time, Counter-Site Korea, Guilty Gear Collab. The Guilty Gear Collab, they have a counter pass for So Bad Guy. So Bad Guy was a counter, uh, counter pass. And a lot of people weren't happy because like, you cannot pull for, for, you have to buy, you have to spend money. So it's quite hard to balance things out. Some free-to-play players are going to complain because they cannot have anything and it's FOMO. They want to participate in the collab too. They want the, they want the Gaurgura skin too. So I'm guessing, yeah, it is what it is. I will trade the Code Gas collab. Why would you trade it? Also, it's a problem for new players since if they get skins, they need to roll for employees, some of which don't have banner yet. Okay, unless they make special banners featuring them with a the skin already. That's gonna be a tough one. That's gonna be tough. People love other games with just collab skins. Honkai had $150 collab skins with EVA? Huh? Wow, I didn't know about this. I didn't know about this. Honkai has... Okay. They also made Asuka a playable character, so no, it wasn't just skins. Okay, that's a... that If, if there's a playable character and there's skins, that's a much more well thought collab people forget about her since game is mostly meta driven she has zero usage damn out of meta characters there's also the fact that even if you focus on just the skins between honaki third what is honaki third guys what the heck is Hon honaki honkai aki third and counter strike Hona honkai third eva skin could be pulled for using gems that players could farm or save beforehand but the collab skins for counter side, if we compare them to the skins we already have in the game, are bought using premium currency. That's only... Uh, yeah. We, do, we don't know yet, but yeah. We don't know yet. <coughs> he meant the skin Honkai Evangelion. Yes. That's the point. If Global gets exclusive employees, that can be good. It will piss off some KR players since they are not getting them. I'm guessing that could be a thing, right? That statement makes no sense since skins, they don't get it too. So it already pissed them off regardless. Also, revenue-wise, CS isn't doing so good in KR. They don't need to care for them. People always say this revenue thing in KR. The truth is, you never know how well Counter-Side is doing because you will never see their PC side of things. Ah, You will never know the true revenue of Counter-Side KR, Counter-Side Taiwan, Counter-Side C server, Counter-Side JP, or Counter-Side Global. Because every single part of this there's a way to pay with the PC client. Except for CN, I think. CN, you still have to pay from the phone, from what I heard. Right? God Eater collab. CS is coming from KR. Why ditch KR? But yeah, it is what it is. We can for sure say C. Okay, no, no. I wouldn't exactly put this collab on a pedestal. As a current CS player, I can't exactly tell you how disappointing it was to hear that they were only skins, but still being presented as units. Okay. Wait, Counterside C is... Oh my god! Wow! Who is... Their source is Sensor Tower. Sensor Tower is only iOS and Android, which is what I'm trying to say. Uh, you don't know the PC side of things. So Sensor Tower is like... You only know one side of the things, you know? Technically, no, but there's minimal interaction close to zero between community and publisher. Ooh! Zelong Dong Hater! Rise up! There's no roadmaps, there's no coupon codes, there's no collapse. Damn! Blaming Zelong Dong for no coupon codes. Wow. 
while blaming Zlongdong for no coupon codes? Also, I heard publishers trying to speed up Taiwan server so they can be synchronized. Also, I heard rumor that they are doing it to announce end of service so they can focus all their resource on Archland that will come out in December. What? See, end of service! No way! Nice rumor, guys. Nice rumor. Wow. Wow, Zalong haters. Damn. See out of service. End of service. Damn. I hope not, man. I hope not. You like this drama? Region block. No way. C, man. My, my collection on C server. It's all gone. It's all useless now. Look at all the Awakens I have. Wow. Look at all the Awakens. Wow. E1, almost max. Wow. Awaken heal day, 102. I got two Awaken Seiyun. One Awaken Seiyun here. One Awaken Seiyun here. Wow. Hype. Damn. It's all go end of service soon? Oof. I'm a bit worried. <laughs> end of always like sort out online, unleash bleeding. Why I got two Jack? I got him by accident as well. It's an accident. I got lucky. 10 pulls. I got him in two. Got two in 10 pulls. That would be dumb of them to EOS, one of their highest monthly revenue game. And it is second last month with just minimal effort. Taiwan is handled by Game Beans, not Zelong Games. Game Beans. Yeah, but I think Game Beans is a same parent company or something like that of Zelong Games. It's like a it's not it's not Zelong Games directly, but it's like a parent company from what I heard. I need to investigate further, but do you guys know anything about Game Beans? It's like <laughs> Game Beans. Okay, let's have a look. Game Beans. Wow. What is this game? Wow, Game Beans. Oh shoot. Yeah, what is this? Is this a new uh Casey Beans Beans this nuts? I don't know man. Game Beans. So they are managing Counterside. This is by the long game though. I think it's a parent company. See Langrisser is here. Langrisser is here. Goddess of Genesis is the long game literally. It's just different name. Goddess of Genesis, I'm pretty sure it's the long game last time. They shut it down. That's why there was drama. Uh Langrisser as well. Langrisser is the long games as well. So I'm pretty sure Game Beans is just like a, a different name, but it's like a you know, now parent company, sort of different company. It's like under under the long games or something. Maybe the long game maybe Game Beans is the main one, the long game is under Game Beans, I don't know. Langrisser got collapsed two weeks ago. <laughs> the long or undercover? It's probably the developer idea to synchronize both and nobody knows the reason. I wanna know where you get your rumors, but that's just crazy. Yo, where did this guy get rumors about EOS? Huh? Well, that's why it's rumors. Basically, five skins of pre-existing characters. And I guess they aren't free? Question mark? Wow. Maybe one is free, some crystal, some premium currency. Okay, this one we never know. We will never know until once it comes to the later date. He's a low-key spy. I don't expect all skins to be paid for, okay? If I had to guess, one skin will be free. Ooh! One skin is free, guys! To get fans of Hololife into the game. There's a chance, there's a chance. Another skin will probably be purchasable with quartz. Since when they release a new batch of skins, they usually, not always, release a skin that is purchasable with quartz. But that is the most I expect seeing that they need to make some cash for these skins. Especially since one of them is an awakened skin. What do you guys think? All farmable copium? Come on. It's a skin, but damn, looks high quality. I'm guessing all of them will be paid skins. Counterside skins are always nuts in terms of quality. I agree. They are always expensive too, sadly, but that's really go out on all the skins. I think Counterside is one of the better skins. You left out the most important part. They asked for admin coins for 98% of them, which is a paid currency, which you can't even obtain as free to play. By the way, yes, costing money is the meaning of expensive. Thank you. Dang, shot back at free to play player. Wow. You are correct. However, that my comment was somewhat vague. That's my bad. Wow, drama happening already? Okay, what's this? 
The upside is that with admin sub, the skins are very cheap compared to other gachas. Damn, he got downvoted by free to play. Free to play destroyed him. Yep, with a change of permanent skins, it's relatively cheap to get them as long as you are patient with the sub. This collab though, it turns out uh, like the usual AC skins, people would definitely need to swipe to get most of it, if not all of this, if they didn't prepare for it. I'll wait to see on the details as I'll be surprised they sell them on admin coins. I'd expect a free KC bin and one of them 1 to 2 quarts, but it does look rather high quality. Cheap skins in other games equals a static PNG. No voice changes when you equip them. Oh yeah, that's also the voice is also a good thing. You guys need to consider like when you equip them, they have a different voice lines. Wow, he wrote an essay. Oh ho ho, lovely challenge you got there. Destiny Child Global skins add more voice lines. While Awakening, you unlock more voice lines too. Skins are all free to play, available. Everything is live 2D too. And Static PNG is not bad in games. There was a game I played years ago called My Turn, which had Static PNG for characters and their skins, but shit was so well made that it was part of its beauty, which in you had voice lines for every character they unlock the more you use them in matches. You are defending paid skins by saying they are superior and that's why you paid. I am demonstrating why those claims of superiority are not true by comparing them with same things offered but in better conditions. Please brag less about why you paid 20 bucks for a skin. No one would like to hear it. Wow! Wow, never defend a skin, guys. Never defend a skin. You're gonna get destroyed in Reddit. Never. Guys, learn from your lesson today. Today is the day you guys learn. Never defend a skin. Alright, if skin is pay to win, never defend it. Wow. You, you're gonna get destroyed, man. You are gonna get destroyed. My god. Defending a skin is the last thing any human being wants to do. Wow, I would be happy with Orca getting Gura skin. Oh yeah, Orca and Gura would be quite good. Heated? Damn. Damn, he just proved it, man. Lovely challenge. Wow, he's, this guy is coming for you. If all the skins are paid, then I will still die alongside the sea server. What? I honestly don't have any means of purchasing anything in the global server, so it's all pointless if they are paid lol. Same, migrated from C to self-proclaimed global. F, Google policy. You can use Steam client for purchase if you live in C. Wow. Okay, you can get someone who's trusted to top up for you. A service can be found easily with middleman. Damn, he's teaching how to do the middleman thing. Wow. Honestly, since we aren't getting the GG collab, they could have just reskinned the Guilty Gear characters to Hololife and gave that to us instead. No, they can't. Not a player could have started for the collab, but it skins. What a trash way to waste big collab like Hololife. Okay, a lot of people are kind of... Honestly, I'm glad these are only skins. A lot of people were expecting Awakened characters. Uh, but yeah, now we can now pull, right? Ingrid is better. If only collapse work like that. Not a single playable. End my existence. No money for so much. And even if it were, I didn't renew my card. I like Hololife, but like these girls are bad voice actors? Whoa! These girls are bad voice actors? The lines feel awkward, and maybe I don't notice it when they're casually streaming, but some of their voices just aren't good. Whoa! This guy is going to get attacked by Hololife. Hololife uh, fans? Wow. This guy is like, man, he, he got to stay off Reddit now. They're going to receive, D he's going to receive DM from Hololife members. <laughs> How do you call them bad voice actors? Wow. Better than Epic 7 K-pop. A pre-registration website, yes. Uh, need to pull for the characters to use the skins. Unless they give out the units for free. Nah, it's not going to happen. I wish Countersight C would do a ho collab with Hololife ID. That would be a good idea actually. That would be a good idea. But then Zalong Dong. Why is that one guy sitting so hard because of VTuber collab? <laughs> you could ask him directly. Wait, what? I would go back to this game but suddenly I realized that I have heavily invested C account that I quitted months ago. Hmm. Okay, it looks like I think I just want to get a collective uh, thoughts on what I can see from Reddit. So it looks like a lot of people don't like the the, the collab as much. Which is which is fair, which is fair. Reddit don't like it, that's fair. Alright, not everybody has to like it. How are people mad about this collab? It's perfect for global question mark? 
With how rushed Global is, don't have to stress about our very limited pools. Since they are skins, it doesn't put any pressure on people not interested in the IP to be forced to pull meta units. No limited time meta units we have to worry about, which was a huge issue with the Guilty Gear collab that multiple people have complained about. The biggest thing that is HUGE exposure for the game that really needs it right now as it stands. Wow. If the skins have EN voice line, I don't like it. I think it will have both. <coughs> First impression was disappointing because we were expecting actual units, but it's a thing where the more you think about it, the better it is. Imagine being a new player in Korea and being forever effed because you don't have two collab units while the rest of them are getting more than collection pieces to those that would want to use them. I hope we never get the Guilty Gear collab. I really don't want to get times 8 of an operator of a literal character who I didn't even remember who was in the show. This guy don't want the Guilty Gear collab? Also, if they make the units easy to acquire, 4 out of 5 are great for new players. KC Bin still needs improvements, and we can actually try to push unit viability because they aren't exclusive one time only. Wow. This guy had min maxing on C. Wow. OMG! Downvoted! Aha! Downvoted! Never be OMG, guys. Are you kidding me? I just deleted the game not too long ago? Guys, he just deleted the game. Now, he's coming back for Hololife collab. But, he get downvoted. Wow. 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 So, Reddit, so far, I would say, um, I would say Reddit don't really like the collab as much. Similar to you guys. Similar to most of the YouTube. Wait, I'm curious about the YouTube on DRM. What do you guys think of the YouTube on DRM?